Hi, today I'm going to show you how to add a fave icon to your website. What is a fave icon? It's this little icon here that shows up in your browser tab or next to your, your URL that shows up also in your bookmark bars. Um, and it basically is a little icon that represents your website. Right now you see the Wix icon because I'm in the Wix editor and that's their fave icon. But to add one to my own site, what you want to do is go into Wix.com, log in so that you are seeing your site here. Um, if you have multiple sites, just click here to look at all your sites and select the site that it is that you want to use the fave icon on and hit select site. The next step is to click on manage site and now you're going to be in your site manager. Uh, this, there's all kinds of stuff you can do in here. You can set up your SEO settings, you can set up um, your analytics, your social, like a Facebook share image and so forth. But today we're going to look at the domain and find this fave icon image here. That is, this is where you're going to upload an image. The nice thing about Wix is it lets you use any icon that you want. Um, you don't have to create an actual specific .ico formatted icon file. You can actually use a JPEG or a PNG file, a PNG file. PNG files are nice because they allow you to have transparency on your icon um, so it shows the background color behind it um, if desired. You'll have to create the PNG file in Photoshop or whatever image editor you use and make sure you save it as a square file. Wix recommends a 16 by 16 inch or sorry, 16 by 16 pixel sized image. Um, I actually would recommend going higher than that, at least doing a 32 by 32 pixel image because it will display nicer on retina displays. Um, so the 32 by 32 solves the retina display thing. So size it square, make sure it's at least 32 by 32. And then once you have that saved somewhere on your desktop or on your computer, you're going to navigate to it and hit open and upload it to your website. Once that's uploaded, make sure it has the little check mark next to it and click on apply. Once you've applied it, you're all done. Now that fave icon is now associated with your domain and will show up in browser windows. To test it, you can go to your website and check it out and see if that is showing up here. And yes, it is showing up here as a little icon. Now, one thing to note, if you if it doesn't show up right away, make sure to close out of all your browser windows and then clear your browser's cache. Uh, just Google, how do I clear my browser's cache if you don't know how to do that in your browser. Um, and then once you've, you've cleared the cache, go back to your page, reload it, and it should show up right away. Sometimes it might still be cached with an old version. So just keep that in mind, you know, be patient, refresh your cache or close out of your browser window and reopen it to see it. And that's it. So now this icon will show up if anybody bookmarks my page or it shows up now in my browser window next to this instead of the Wix icon, which is great. So have fun. That's it. It's a simple uh, process and uh, enjoy.